This will be a brief demonstration of Roadrunner for Confluence. It lets you synchronize multiple remote Confluence servers down to your local Confluence instance running a personal license on your desktop or laptop. So, let's go ahead and quickly look at this. The first thing we want to do is define two Confluence servers. Once you've done that, you just click Add Server. And here I've updated a, the settings for a local server. Now let's go ahead and define our synchronization. So we're going to click on Refresh. Which brings up a list of all the servers, or I'm sorry, all the spaces, and we're just going to synchronize this. Our test space I've set up, and so we go from the remote server Artemis, and then we want to select the local server here. And click on Save Sync, and that defines a synchronization. Uh, you can select all these spaces if you wanted to synchronize the entire server. So now we can just click on Start Sync, and it fires up. And as you can see, you get real-time feedback with progress bars and information about what it's syncing. So it's synchronizing the different pages. Here it's synchronizing a couple of attachments. And uh, it's actually faster than that. I put in some artificial delays so that you can see the progress. So let's quickly look at what happened. Um, here is the remote space that we were synchronizing. Click on the page hierarchy here, we can see that there's a home page and some children pages. Here is the local server. I uh, did not have that space. I'm going to click refresh. And now our test space exists with the same information. And if we again browse the page hierarchy, we'll see it's the same. And additionally, uh, child page one on both the remote server and now the child server has attachments which are available. So this is a very early version of Roadrunner for Confluence, but you can see it's starting to take shape. Thanks for listening and please uh, give me any feedback. Thanks.